is our second trial. Try to. Okay. together okay um, now let's go ahead and find out what the difference is difference is going to be when we use the white marble okay so one person from each group okay um, this course is called amusement park and we're using connects okay, connects is kind of like Lego except connects has all these connectors and rods uh, rather than bricks that Lego has and this particular course is to figure out the science behind amusement rides and so um, right now we're, we're doing this uh, inclined plane with a circular loop and we want to find out how high does the marble or the ball that we're using uh, how high up the ramp it needs to be in order for it to complete the loop uh, without falling off there you go. There you go. and so it, it's um, actually a, a very basic uh, physics course that we're doing but it's for fifth and sixth graders so they're going to jump in science by doing this Uh, the primary thing that they need to measure in this experiment is the height above the track, but we also need to um, look at what is the diameter of this loop that there be. Um, the, the, they need to have the ball go through, and um, we'll be looking at. Uh, what is the velocity that this ball is traveling to go through the loop? And we'll do some uh, some math, math calculations to figure that out. Oh, no, that was a no. Yeah, it's 46. 46. Centripetal force. And uh, that, that speed that you need in order for it to make that loop. Centripetal. Centripetal force. 